Hello, dear heart dwellers. Brother Jim began. My name is Jim O'Connor, and I'm the late husband of Jimlin O'Connor. In March of 2017, Jimlin suffered what should have been two fatal heart attacks and visited heaven twice and came back. She has an important message to share with all of you, which you will see in about a minute. In March this year, 2021, Jimlin went to heaven forever. We are in the end times, and many people are still sitting on the fence. The fence belongs to the devil. It's time to get off the fence. Please listen to what Jimlin has to say and take it to heart. God bless you all. You don't know me, but Jesus does. On March 2nd, 2017, I died twice. I had a 52% heart attack on the right side, which is also known as the widow maker. I had two strokes and two grand mal seizures. I spent 45 days in the unit at Winchester Medical Center where I was cared for by some very good doctors and nurses. And Jesus watched over me the whole time. What's important for you to know is that for five minutes and 34 seconds, I was allowed the privilege of sitting in the lap of Jesus like a little girl in a little white nightgown, him holding me, telling me it was going to be okay. He took my hand and he touched his face and he said, and I quote, why are you so surprised? I know your every thought. I had never told anyone that my greatest desire was to touch the face of God. I was so impressed that out of all the people that had to be dying at that time, he took time to spend with me. I recovered from that still trying to recover from that, the kidney failure and all the other stuff that goes with it. But I recovered from that. And one thing that Jesus told me before he let me go back was that there were a lot of people that were on the fence about him. And they needed me to tell them this, to push them over the fence. So if you're on the fence about Jesus, get off the fence and get on the right side. The end times are near. Jesus is coming, and you don't want to be left behind. I love you. I pray for you. And I wish you all good things. God bless you.